Hey everybody, welcome to another exciting uh, edition of the Coffee Cast. The reason I say it's exciting is because two things. One, Megan's not with us this week. And two, nobody prepared us for that. <laughs> I brought notes. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, that's basically what Necessary we have. Necessary today, yep. So we are joined by manager Dulcie. Hello. Oh, so how's things in the Wailuku store? Things are fantastic. I, I noticed a lot as we're getting closer to the holidays, there's a lot of chaos laughter. Yes. Definitely. Mm. Things are being forgotten. My deliveries get a little mixed up because certain places aren't open certain days and the stress level kind of. <laughs> yeah, and then here you are. <laughs> right. Cackling oh. through. Oh my gosh. Well, I mean, it is a happy time though. Oh, definitely. You know, I mean, everybody's definitely. getting ready to do the whole family mm -hmm. holiday thingy. Yep. And you guys are kind of like an extended family. Oh, here. yeah. Monday night we did a Friendsgiving. It was oh. fantastic. Everybody brought a dish. We got to try a bunch of different foods and hang out and have fun. And then I was like, wait, I'm starting my stomach stretching on Monday. Just imagine the amount of food I'm going to eat by Thursday. <laughs> you know, and this is why I keep telling people, it's like, we need to do one of those pre-Thanksgiving meal marathons, you know? Right. Because yeah. otherwise you wake up and you're like, I'm not going to eat until the time of day. And then it's like, wait, I can't eat as much because I didn't right. I didn't expand. <laughs> See, that's what we should do is we should start we should start a tradition. Like the day before Thanksgiving, everybody comes down to the Wailuku Coffee Company. Just fills up. Just grabs, just grabs a smoothie. No, just grabs okay. a smoothie. Okay, we start like You're going to see. There's a beauty to this plan. Okay. Then they're going to run up and down the block. <laughs> say, the entire time you're open. <laughs> the entire time. Yeah. So seven maybe, to five. Yeah, maybe we give them shirts. Maybe even little signs with arrows. High fives at both ends. Keep right. going. Yeah, you know. And then, that way when Thanksgiving rolls around, there's famished. Guilt-free, too. Right. They'll yeah. be like, I burned so many calories yesterday. <laughs> I need to replenish. I need to replenish. From all I did, though, yeah. For and the and this is week. one of the funny things, too, because you mentioned this earlier. Right around Thanksgiving, you would figure people would be so sick of turkey and all of that stuff. <laughs> But your Thanksgiving sandwich that we featured. The turkey crayon. The turkey yes. crayon sandwich. The sales go kind of crazy around this time. <laughs> Seasonal favorite. <laughs> go figure. I don't know what that's about. The turkey cranberry. Everybody loves turkey and cranberry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> well, okay, so before we get into our fundraising yes, stuff, which, definitely. once again, ill prepared for, <laughs> uh, what is this? Ooh. Today we have a pecan magic bar. Okay. And it looks like the graham cracker crust. They switch it up on us. Sometimes they do a more of a cookie, uh, sugar cookie crust, and the graham cracker crust. I personally, I like the graham cracker crust. And then it's uh, so much coconut, sweetened condensed milk. Looks like we got chocolate chips and pecans, and they're always putting different toppings in there, and that sweetened condensed milk just, just holds it all together. Oh my God. Yeah. Now I see why you're kind of always <laughs> fun. Because like, there's, there's times I come by, and you know, there's people in line, and they're just all, but here's and, you guys behind the counter. Right? And we get to serve them a magic bar. And you know, if you buy a magic bar, you can't be sad. It really is magic. <laughs> it is. Oh my god. And they are definitely shareable though. Okay. It well, is one of those things where I have the biggest sweet tooth, but I still prefer to have somebody to share it with. I can see why. Let's I can break see it why. In half. I forgot a fork. Sorry guys. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I trust you. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't trust me, but I trust you. <laughs> Here you go. Or I'll clean up the mess if we make a mess. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So around this time of the year, you guys usually do your, your fundraising stuff. Yes. Now, I mean, you do it every month on one Saturday. Right. Yes. But this year, just like most of, well, well, every other year ahead of it, you guys join a specific kind of charity. Yes. Mm. So our seasonal charity seems like always, I've only been here. This is going to be my third year. So mm. every year I've been here so far. Yes, our annual holiday fundraiser is for da, 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 the Friends of the Children's Justice Center. I have a hard time with that. So we're going to shortcut it. The FCJC. See mm. if I can remember that. <laughs> the FCJC. Yes. Now, what do they do? They are local. They are a fantastic charity. I mean, I got a list of stuff they do. Do we want to? We can start at the top. They help provide special needs services for school-related expenses. That's pretty cool. Everything from medical, it looks like, to training, transportation, mm -hmm. uh, character building and self-esteem. It sounds like they do a lot of programs, a lot of stuff out in the community where they're getting kids hands-on and really helping them out. Um, it says holiday gifts. They provide about 1,200 holiday gifts for children each year. Last year, 
we provided 200 of those. Mm. So this year we want to raise the bar a little bit more, a little bit more, try to get a few more toys in. And so how we're proposing to do that, you bring in a toy mm -hmm. to either Wailuku or Haiku, you get a free drink on us. Free drink for helping a That's child, it. right? Oh my gosh. So there's no... I'm sorry I didn't say anything sooner. That magic bar was quite rich. <laughs> So I said they're very shareable. They are. <laughs> Not good for conversation, though. <laughs> you know, I was like... Wash it down with some pumpkin latte. Oh, yes. That's what I'm, <laughs> that's what I'm having today. Because, once mm. again, we're talking about season stuff. Yes. And, you know, around this time of the season, especially when it comes to, to children's gifts and stuff, you see all the big commercials on television and stuff yeah. like that. But And they're seeing them. They want them. Yeah, but they... <laughs> The, uh, there's also the charity commercials, the ones that are like, oh, send us money, send us money, send us money. And when we when we think about it, it's like, yeah, these are all real good causes, but mm -hmm. this actually benefits people right on these streets. Yep, right here, for sure. Yeah, and that's okay. one of the things when we talk about charity, you guys are very, very good about this, Definitely. making sure that your, your charities are here on yeah. island. We love our community, and yeah, we definitely want to help local, mm. for sure. We're a little island, and... We gotta share the love, and we got a lot of love that comes through here. And okay, yeah. so how long is this toy drive gonna last? Cause it's gonna be from. So the boxes are out. I got a box over here. Okay, I saw the it. box. I had two. We sent one to Haiku. Oh. And so it's ready. You know what we should totally do? Competition. Oh. Between the two stores, I think bet. about this. Because yep. Haiku is the new kid. It's young, it's scrappy, it's got right. something to prove. Let's see if you can keep up. Yeah. <laughs> so like here's that. the deal. If you're in country, up at uh, the Haiku location, go there, get your free drink when you get your toy. There you, you know, go. Make sure you bring the toy. Yep, show the toy to the cashier. Mm -hmm. Start sipping on that coffee and... Yeah. And then, you know, every time you do it in Haiku, tell them, I'm trying to beat Wailuku. Yes. <laughs> I want to hear all about it down here. Right. And then right. We'll, we'll, we'll step we'll up our same. game. Yep. So if you're down here in Wailuku where, <clears throat> I'm just going to say, I, I'm i kind of biased too. I mean, I know I'm a country guy when I go home, but my daily life is here in Wailuku, so. Right. I'm kind of biased. We're stop. A little so biased. So you're rooting for us. I'm rooting. I'm rooting. So Good. you should come to, well, either location. Both locations. But this one. <laughs> this one. <laughs> I mean, like, if you take one toy to Haiku, come here with two. There we go. All right. There we go. That's Just a, that's to keep the numbers. Semi-fair. Yeah, I right. feel it's fair. <laughs> and, and you know what? I I think I should plan a surprise for which store wins. Oh, let's do that. Okay. We'll okay. Let's do it. Yep. All right. So this is how it's going to go. For the whole run of their annual holiday fundraiser, this time it's going for the Friends of the Children's Justice Center. Center. Yes. You know, the funny thing is, is when I see the initials, I can't really say them. Don't tell Alec. <laughs> Don't tell Alec. I'm a huge fan of anime. So every time I see him, I'm like, FLCL? <laughs> see, I don't know what that is. got to be an anime <laughs> freak, and then you'd be like, oh, my God, Furikuri, you watch that? <laughs> but, You're yeah, I mean, it. this year we want to kind of up the bar, so let's, let's, let's make it competitive. Okay? okay. So go to Haiku, drop off a toy, get a free drink. Come to Wailuku, drop off a toy, get a good feeling in your heart. <laughs> And a free drink. Definitely. But whichever store wins, I'll do something special okay. for that store. Okay. I don't know what it is yet. Only good can come out of it, so let's, yes. You've not worked with me often, have you? <laughs> Wait, so, so winning could be a bad thing? Wait, let's discuss it. <laughs> depends, depends. But everybody wins with this. You get a good feeling. Definitely. Kids get toys, and it's in this local community. Right. And of course... You get a little pep in your step because you get a free drink. Right. Mm -hmm. Definitely. So, what do we do after we take over the world, Dulcie? I mean, this is a kind of cool plan. Right. We've already got the coffee cast. Well, what's next? I know. Gosh, I bet Megan right now open. is going, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> oh, but everybody, uh, do remember to have a safe, happy holiday season. Yes. Uh, are you guys, you guys are closed on Friday, right? Or For are you? <laughs> You're like, what? You, need, what? you need coffee before you go shopping? No, we are open all day. You're open all the day. The only time we are... It's noon on... Tomorrow, yes. Yeah. Thanksgiving hours are from 8 a.m. until noon. Mm. So, okay. we have volunteers to work. We're not forcing anybody. Come in and get your coffee. Go home, start cooking. Yeah. And we're here all day Friday for all your pick-me-ups in between all of those fun shopping sprees. And shop small. Come to Market Street. 
There is a lot shop, of good shop, shops shop. here. Yeah. Definitely. And remember that Saturday is Shop Small Saturday. Right. That's where you're supposed mm -hmm. to go to your mom and pops. Right. I'm just going for a back to back, you know, <laughs> Maui Black Friday and then a small shop Saturday. There we go. Yeah. But if you are out shopping, remember, grab one extra, bring it down here. And coffee's on us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, and you we know, appreciate that. Yeah. whichever store wins, we'll do something. <laughs> uh, until next time, I'm pretty sure Megan is regretting every one of her life decisions that led us to host <laughs> right. the coffee cast. But never again. I know, mm. but Magic Bar is wonderful. Come get one of those. Yes. And pumpkin spice sure. latte, too. Till next time, <laughs> have a good holiday. Happy holidays. Mm.